hey guys welcome to my channel hope you're all doing well so scorpio this reading will be for you if you have any scorpio placements okay or if you're dealing with a scorpio so let's see what's going on for you guys we start with the moonology deck first oh by the way if you haven't subscribed like share comment if you have already subscribed thank you very much i appreciate you guys so let's just see the energy let's just see the overall energy for all the scorpios so we'll be using some oracle cards to start with and then we'll be using some tarot please tell me about scorpios what do they need to know what does spirit want them to know what does spirit want scorpio to know Thank you. So we have nothing is yet set in stone. Hold your vision and what do you need to release? So there may be some, you may be having um, some kind of ideas, some plans, okay, but nothing is like, okay, this is what we're doing, this is what I'm doing, this is how it's going to go, this is the time that it's going to happen, okay? So hold your vision, don't give up on it. This is something that this is something i'm not sure exactly what it is i feel like for some of you guys it's a passion it could be a relationship okay it could be you know work something like that a goal that you have okay either way i feel like um hold your vision don't give up on it don't don't just give in don't just be like okay do you know what no that's silly really try to just there's something here that you need to release okay there's something here that you need to release. Let me let's get one more card from this deck. Let's get one more card. It could be a way of thinking, it could be a person. For some of you guys, it could be um, moving home, it could be like um certain friends around you, family members, okay. Also, what I am getting as well, it could be um, actual material things that you have in your home. You know, like when you hold them to certain things from your past and it's just the energy is not good. So for some of you, it is that believe in the impossible. So I'm getting like, think, think big, think big. So let's get some cards from here. What other messages would you like uh, Scorpio to know? What does spirit have for Scorpio? What messages does spirit have for Scorpio? Thank you. So we have moon. Take note of intuitive messages. Okay, some of you guys could be having a lot of dreams or certain signs or numbers. When, if you feel like you're... I just got confusion as well. So if you're unsure and you're getting certain messages, research them, okay? Okay that your answers are there okay so if you're seeing um you know 11 11 333 stuff like that okay have, just check it or if also as well i don't this is for somebody definitely if a certain number has been following you for years and you're like it's almost like haunting you like what look at that number what does that number mean for you look it up actually funny enough scorpio i'll share with you this um a certain number was following me for years and you know what it said to me it said i need to move past what i'm currently doing you know i need to like release certain things in my life and move on to the next stage and I actually wasn't for years and then when i actually looked up this number and different um i was just like hold i was like i wish i'd known that years ago but sometimes you stumble across things when you need to okay when you need to so let's see what other messages do you have for Scorpios? Trader. We have exchange energy to create abundance. Okay. Yeah. Hold your vision and exchange energy to create abundance. So you may need to network right now. You may need to, um, you know, actually speak out those things that you want you know contact those people get back to those people email those people whatever it is answer that phone continue it some of you guys may feel like um 
you may be giving up on something no keep going believe in the impossible okay okay that's the last two cards we have for you scorpio then we'll move on to the tarot we have water guardian that's you that's you scorpio so water guardian connect with your emotions so what i'm getting oh okay so above that we have what do you need to release connect with your emotions so some of you guys even though you're scorpio some of you guys may scorpio is known to have the most intense emo sorry about that guys i just got a phone call some of you scorpios um scorpios are known to have quite intense energy but do you know what the amazing thing about that is being able to manifest things so um some, sometimes you guys go through things and you may feel like you don't want to address that so when you feel a certain way it's not for you to push it down it's for you to address it and say how does this make me feel why do i feel this way how can i overcome this the best way to respond to this this is very important okay it's something to do with how you deal with your emotions scorpio that's really going to get you through to the next stage in your life it's really going to enhance your life okay believe in the impossible believe if you if you say to yourself you know no this is just how i am or i think scorpio is scorpio fixed i'm not too sure if scorpio is a fixed sign i can't remember but um scorpio is also transformation you know is transformation so you guys i have said this before in your readings you will experience things that that test you that test you and you feel like why is this person testing me why is but it's for you to react in a way and not not in a way that just at the moment so sometimes what i'm what i am what i'm actually getting guys is like for you to take a moment to um to actually digest how you're feeling what's being said and not try to take it so personally just you know analyze your feelings your thoughts and then don't react to it straight away take time okay because i feel like this will benefit you because we have after this elder move beyond ancestral patterns move beyond ancestral patterns so this may be because you saw certain people acting this way i.e your mother your father your siblings okay stuff like that but it's not for you to respond in that way it's not for you to react in that way okay believe in the impossible it's so important okay guys so that's just a little message from spirit just to say you can achieve anything you want to okay but it's something definitely to do with your emotions here okay um that needs addressing and me as a water sign myself, me as a Pisces, I totally get that. Once I kind of got, um, took charge of my emotions and, and didn't let things bother me so much, I become much more grounded. Um, my other earth, my earth placements helped me with that. But um, it's also for you to, to um, as a water sign, we're going to th feel things. We're going to feel things, okay? And sometimes if when we feel things, we turn to drink, we turn to smoking, we turn to, you know, certain things. Not always. You know but we can have quite addictive personalities as well water signs so just it's something to be aware of okay what other messages do you have for scorpio okay come straight out scorpio so we have for you the nine of swords the ace of cups the ace of pentacles judgment two of cups and the two of wands so there has been a situation that stressed you out um some some of you guys could have been having nightmares or something that's kept you up at night there's some something that's bothered you okay um but i why do i feel like there's a situation now you don't have this this doesn't have to be romantic okay i'm getting like either you or somebody wants to um offer you love a new start a new beginning okay somebody could be asking for a second chance okay it doesn't have to be romantic it could, it could be a friend that you had a lot of love for somebody who was a soulmate okay the two of cups some kind of soulmate energy that you've been dealing with okay two of wands yeah somebody is kind of like hoping and wishing for a second chance a diff to for things to go a different way and i feel like it can go a different way if somebody connects with their emotions and re reacts differently to things okay now, this might not be you scorpio this could be very much a person that you're thinking of right now it doesn't have to be you it could be somebody that you can flip the roles if you need to but i feel like once this once this once your emotions or once their emotions are addressed and somebody's more um um in touch with their emotions and doesn't let something bother them 
and they, they move beyond ancestral patterns, okay, because somebody's watching what their mother did or their father did or the, somebody around them did, okay, and they respond in that way and it's not helping them actually. This reminds me of the Virgo reading, okay, this reminds me of the Virgo reading. Um, oh my God, I was supposed to do, I was supposed to do Libra, I've just realised I've done that twice today where I've skipped over signs, but it was meant to be. There's no such thing as coincidences. There's no such thing as mistakes. I don't, I don't believe that. So there's a reason why this message has come out to you. So some of you guys, you have Virgo in your chart or you're dealing with a Virgo. So check that reading as well because it reminds me of that too, okay? And it's also, they, they, they were also having troubles with moving past something, okay? But once they do that, amazing changes. Not just externally is internally okay and it's something that you will take with you for the rest of your life guys and not only you you will help others after you okay the fruit the future generation your friends your family around you okay but i'm going to leave it there guys i hope that was helpful please like share subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next reading bye guys